Welcome everyone. Today's title, Are You Weary and Burdened? is about finding new peace and new security within ourselves and in our lives during these crazy times that overwhelm us. Unless we can find some peace and security within ourselves first, it's going to be difficult to feel peaceful and secure out there, well, in the world around us. Unless we can learn to find love within ourselves first, it will be difficult to expect others to give us the love that we need out there to fill us. And you don't have to feel overwhelmed, burdened, or insecure, even when you're being bombarded by life. There are ways to take the reins of your mind and stop the noise and confusion in your head. Stop it from the anger, the worries, and the fears that you feel. Take a moment, sit down, lie down, still your mind. Put those thoughts to the sidelines. They're not going anywhere. And nor are you going to receive any productive results from them in the state. Jesus said, come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Because Jesus said, just stop and rest. He understood the pain and the struggles of life that we would face. The core of our pains and our struggles haven't changed much since that time. Life still challenges each of us in our own way. But if you, but if you do not rest your mind, your soul, and your body, you're in danger of life's challenges devouring you. And that's not what the divine God in the universe wants for you. That's not how Jesus taught us to live, even in our darkest times. He reminds us to stay determined and to keep following the path of light. Yes, but he also reminds us of the need to take personal time to sit, to rest, be still, and refresh our mind, our manna, our energy, our spirit. When we are depleted, we're useless to ourselves and to others. However, when you stop what you're doing for a moment, what you're saying, feeling, still your mind and breathe, the first feeling you will get is a feeling of peace. And you'll realize that all the chaos in your mind settles. You'll notice that your challenges, decisions, fears, and worries and concerns have been temporarily sent to the sidelines. Clarity arises and those feelings and concerns do not seem as large or overwhelming as they really may be. This is the space of peace and clarity. And embrace that place for a moment, for minutes, for however long you are able, because this place becomes a refuge for you. Now, all faiths have their own beautiful concept of timeouts for gaining this clarity and wholeness, and all are valid. As a Christian minister and a follower of Yeshua, the Christ, I love how Jesus invites everyone when he offers this, come to me, all you who are weary and burdened, and I will give you rest. Take my yoke upon you and learn from me. For I am gentle and humble in heart, and you will find rest for your souls. For my yoke is easy and my burden is light. The sounds of the words themselves bring calmness, peace, and acceptance, assurance. Now, from the modern translation in the message, if you prefer it, it says, are you tired, worn out, burned out on religion? Come to me. Get away with me and you'll recover your life. I'll show you how to take a real rest. Walk with me. Work with me. Watch how I do it. Learn the unforced rhythms of grace. I won't lay anything heavy or ill-fitting on you. Keep company with me and you'll learn to live freely and lightly. Gotta love those, both versions. I'll leave you with that beautiful promise for now and look out for our next video coming up entitled, What Will Your New Normal Look Like? Until then, may you continue to heal. Keep walking in the light and discover the peace in the heaven that resides within you right now. Also, if you would, please subscribe, share, and like this channel to help it grow. Also, check out facebook.com slash Faith for a variety of content, music, and inspiration. Blessings of peace to you. Thank you for joining me today, and uh, I will see you on the next one. Take care, everyone.